So now let's play with the magnetometer. So I'm going to turn it on and I'm just going to start recording. And so what you're seeing here now is the Earth's magnetic field measured in three dimensions using the IOLAB device. Now, let's carefully rotate this thing to see if we can find the direction of north. And in the north direction, one of the horizontal components of the magnetic fields is going to be zero. The other horizontal component, which will be the northerly component, will be maximum. And there's also going to be an up and down component. So here, what I've done is I have arranged it so that, I'm going to stop this, I've arranged it so that over here, at the end of where I was doing, the, um, the Z component, the one out of the face of this thing, was zero. Okay, so this thing is now oriented, so north is this way, parallel to the, uh, whoops, to the surface of this thing, in the X direction, in other words. So what we have here is we have a magnetic field in the X direction, which is, you can see, 28 microtesla or so. You have no magnetic field in the Z direction, and interestingly, we have a much larger component of magnetic field, which is straight downward in the minus Y direction. That, of course, is because true north in the northern hemisphere is poking into the surface of the Earth. So this is how we can find north uh, using this device. And coincidentally, it agrees exactly with the north that I found using my iPhone, uh, which I don't believe is to be true north, but it, this building is actually full of steel, and so is this desk. So locally where I am right now, north is in the direction pointed to by that x-axis right there.